everybody, I'm Natalia Bonner. Welcome to day 60. Today I'll actually be stitching with two rulers, my 4-in-1 and my Inside Out Machine Quilting Ruler. Let's get stitching! To stitch out this darling design, you'll notice I am using my 4-in-1 and my Inside Out Machine Quilting Ruler. I'll start out by using a white Mark Be Gone marker and marking along the two sides of my block measurement markings at the 1 inch increment. After I've marked all those increments, I'll grab my 4-in-1 Machine Quilting Ruler and I'll stitch my first point-to-point -point curve. Now remember, anytime you're stitching out a point-to-point -point curve, you're going to have your needle right in that corner and your ruler is going to be held a quarter of an inch away from where you want your machine quilting to intersect. After I've stitched my first curve, I'll move along the ditch, moving up one inch to the first marked line. From that line, I'll again use the top side of my four-in-one machine quilting ruler and stitch an echoed curve line. I'll repeat this process moving all the way to the top of the block. Once I reach the top of the block, I will now switch to my inside out ruler and repeat that same process moving back towards the bottom of the block. Now the curve on the 4-in-1 machine quilting ruler and the inside out ruler, the large curve, is the same curve. So I can easily stitch this design and it'll match up perfectly on both sides. Now I do want to point out here, you could stitch out this entire design using just my 4-in-1 machine quilting ruler or just my trailer ruler, inside out ruler, but sometimes holding the ruler behind your foot is a little bit awkward, so by using both rulers it makes it just a little bit easier to manage. friends I hope you enjoyed today's vlog and found a little bit of inspiration with my machine quilting now just remember you can pick up the panel the rulers the thread all of the notions that I'm using in this video today over on my website peaceandquilt.com and don't forget to share your progress pictures over on Instagram using the hashtag let's stitch with Natalia that's where we will be selecting winners for weekly prizes see you all tomorrow